Hi everybody! Welcome back to Playing It Safe with Craig and Company. This is the very special New Year's Eve edition! Yes! New Year's Eve! Yes! Woo! Happy New Year! Yeah! Yeah! Good guys, 2020! Yeah! Right. Okay, that's good. Alright, so, uh, everybody always likes to do the New Year's in Old Vienna thing, so we're going to kind of do that only on a very pared down version. It's me, Liz, uh, Eliza, and Laura. Uh, for this one, and we're going to just start right off. No lectures. This is the aptly named Roses from the South, uh, since we are here in South Texas. Roses from the South by Johann Strauss Jr. We hope you enjoy it.
Hi everyone, it's great to see you. Thank you so much for your support of the Mid-Texas Symphony through the year 2020. It's been a great digital fall season, but we missed playing live in person for you. So in 2021, we're excited to return to the stage and perform these concerts that have been designed to be safe for both you and us. I hope you can join us. Until then, let's all stay safe and healthy and make 2021 a great year for the Mid-Texas Symphony. See you soon and Happy New Year! All right, Roses from the South. Wasn't that lovely? Lovely. I, I, I'm, I'm sounding like uh, Lawrence Welk. Uh, uh, thank you, boys. That was a lovely. Uh, that was my bad Lawrence Welk impression. Okay, here. <laughs> I'm still feeling it. All right, so now, when a violinist gives a recital and they want to play a Viennese waltz, they don't automatically think of Johann Strauss Jr. They think of another great Viennese composer and a great violinist, Fritz Kreisler. And here is Laura with her wonderful rendition of Liebesfreude, Love's Joy by Fritz Kreisler. enjoyed Laura playing Liebesfreude by Fritz Kreisler. Great little piece, isn't it? And she's just really awesome with it. Okay, yeah, give her a hand. Give her a hand. Yes, yes. Yes, New Year's Eve hands. All right, good. Oh, epic fail. It worked in rehearsal. Okay, so uh, you can't finish up a New Year's Eve concert like we're about to do without playing 
that old New Year's Eve favorite, Auld Lang Syne. And I read about what that means and I still don't understand. I mean, if anybody can explain it. What does this song mean? My whole life, I don't know what this song means. I mean, should old acquaintance be forgotten? Does that mean that we should forget old acquaintances? It doesn't mean that if we happen to forget them, we should remember them, which is not possible because we already forgot them. Oh, Harry, look what you've done. Oh, man, that is just such a great movie. My wife and I really, really love it. I had to throw that in there. Okay, so um, back to Old Lang Syne. Uh, I am so glad that I live in a world where someone a long time ago who I absolutely idolize and adore um, went to the trouble of composing or arranging a version of Auld Lang Syne for voices and piano trio. But we don't have voices, so we're covering the voices with violin and viola added in a little arrangement that I've made. And so to find this composer, we're going all the way back towards the beginning of uh, these videos. Oh gosh, about seven months ago when uh, we made our very first attempt at playing real serious chamber music. And of course, it being 2020, who did we turn to? You're wondering, why is our old friend Craig doing a striptease? We turned to Ludwig van Beethoven, Mr. 250 himself, the big birthday boy, who kind of got cheated this year. This was not a great year for him, for us to be able to celebrate him properly, but we're doing the best we can. And so he actually did do this arrangement of Auld Lang Syne, and I am so happy about that, and I hope you enjoy it. It's a lot of fun. And, um, and so before we play it, there's only one thing left to say. This is our final video in the video series that we began about eight months ago, and uh, that started with the Craig's Corona concerts and then has morphed into the Playing It Safe series. Um, we hope that we've brought some, some light and some joy and some happiness into your days. Uh, when you watched these videos. Um, and, and we want to thank you from the bottom of our hearts for being there with us and for supporting the Mid-Texas Symphony, supporting classical music in South Texas. And, and of course, the singing of my dog in the background. And, um, and, and we hope to see you in January live on stage with an all Beethoven program. So we're still kind of making it up to the man. Um, so everybody, have a better 2021. 2020 was a weird year. I think we can all agree on that. And let's hope that 2021 is better and nothing like this ever happens again to us. So, Happy New Year. Best of luck. Of course, play it safe, be smart, and stay well. And we'll see you real soon, hopefully in the real world. Bye. Take care. Thank you.